you know, Dasher. And Dancer. And Prancer. And Vixen. That was awkward. But do you recall a Boise Cemetery maybe home to them all? Here we headed there with Corbin Max, of course, to take a look in this week's Creature Feature. Here we are on location for Creature Feature. We're at Cloverdale Cemetery and Funeral Home with Corbin Maxey, of course, the expert, showing us some reindeer today, some caribou. I understand they're the same thing. Absolutely. Isn't this great? First of all, you guys, did you ever guess in the middle of Boise, we have reindeer right here in the valley? And at a funeral home, too. There's, There's got to be yes, an explanation for that, too, right? It's very interesting. It's very interesting that they have reindeer here, but they've actually been here for several years. Since the 90s, the Cloverdale Funeral Home has had these reindeer. Now, you said it perfectly. Reindeer and caribou are the exact same thing, although they, you know, they're the same genus and species, although reindeer, here's the basic thing, they're domesticated and caribou, they're wild. Okay. okay? So these animals, of course, are domesticated and you can see they're just amazing. Um, and, you know, they're just so fascinating. Can we get closer to this one since yeah, he's, he's kind of following like, us? Now look at this. He is in... <laughs> what did you do, Spencer? <laughs> I guess he, I scared him yeah, away. I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> So I'm here with Corbin. I think it's time to feed the caribou, correct? Yes, yes. Look at this. Now, look at this. You have their special feed. They love this stuff. Now okay. You're going to lead them to their food. On the count of three, I'm going to open the gate. Okay? You're going to have six reindeer coming right towards you. <laughs> great, great. And we have not practiced this. So uh, just keep rolling, and okay. uh, we'll see. So here's the feed right here. Okay. We need to direct them. Okay, ready? All right. All right. bit about these antlers, Corbin. Well, looks these like... antlers are about to get you. Uh, they'll <laughs> use them as a defense mechanism, but what's unique about their antlers right now is a Dixie is in something we like to call velvet, okay? And that's why and they're all furry, right? That's why they're furry, and it's actually made up of a very, very soft tissue. Blood vessels are in there, and um, she'll actually lose the velvet, though. They'll lose this, I guess, I'm gonna, I guess, kind of this fur. Um, they'll lose that in September, and that's when and you'll she, have... she can she can feel that right absolutely she okay. can feel that and it isn't amazing very very soft to the touch yeah now their antlers the males will lose them in december and the females actually will lose their antlers in the spring usually around may they and completely come off they right? completely come well, off i and, did not know that and and they, they actually grew i'm um, just talking with the staff here they, these grew this big in just four months four so months that's ago that's not they even had, a whole year of growth that's right? not, not even a whole year and they're just beautiful the males and females in this species both have antlers which okay. is unusual and all of the deer species only the males have antlers no and also on her fur notice a little bit of, of patchy spots right here yeah. the longer fur she i understand she's shedding right now yeah right? they actually shed and these animals have two layers of fur on top their second layer of fur it's very very coarse um and it's actually kind of hollow these animals are shedding that second layer of fur but when we meet them back in december for our winter you know christmas segment they will look a lot shaggier a lot bigger because they have that fur of course to keep them warm obviously an up close looks thanks so much for calming dixie down a little bit <laughs> Now remember, <laughs> you can see Dixie and all of her reindeer friends, correct, here at the cemetery. Anytime you want, just come and see them in their in their habitat. And you can also see them in holiday parades. So thanks so much for showing us this, Corbin. And be sure to tune in next week for another edition of Creature Feature. Clearly not like walking a dog there, but uh, no, they were they, really nice. Yeah, and they, they like to stop a lot, eat the grass. You kind of have mm -hmm. to tug them along, but no reindeers there with, with reindeer. You should mm -hmm. say no reindeer there with red noses, though, we asked. Yeah, They're I all know. brown. But. All right.